Hi, welcome to the Studentship YouTube channel. In this video, I will share with you how you can make money as a teenager in Nigeria. I know you are wondering, is it really possible to make money as a teenager? The answer is yes. You see, there are two ways you can make money as a teenager in Nigeria. Number one is learning and handwork. Handwork involves physical labor, the use of hands, the use of your hands. Like when you hear someone, someone is a tailor, someone is, a, is an hairdresser, someone is a makeup artist. You know, these are skills that involve the use of the hands. So these are handwork. And there are also skills you can learn, like digital skills that involve the use of the computer and you know, software. I'm talking about programming web design. These are skills that are called D2 skills. So these are the two categories of ways you can make money as a teenager. Now, there's this advice I give to young people. You have to know a skill that aligns with your natural ability and your personality. Because you don't go off and say, because my friend is learning tailoring, then I need to be a tailor. No, you have to go for something that suits you. And I can assure you that by the end of this video, you'll be able to decide on the best skill to learn to make money as a teenager in Nigeria. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. Now, the first way you can make money is through addressing. Addressing is a lucrative skill to learn in Nigeria. No matter the economical situation in Nigeria, no matter how things are hard, you know, ladies who always want to look beautiful by by making their hair going to the salon to make their hair because hair is something that ladies you have to take care of all the time so if you can learn how to make a beautiful hair styles you can make money you can learn hairdressing within six months now the best way to learn this handwork is to register as an apprentice in a hair salon so all you have to do is to meet your parents and tell them that, well, I'm interested in learning hairdressing, they should register you in a hair salon. And one thing I want to let you know is, hairdressing is not for the ladies or the guests only. As a guy, as a boy, as a teenage boy, you can learn hairdressing, you can become an hairdresser. So it just it involves you being persistent, you know, being determined and passionate about the skill. So if addressing is something that you find interesting, then you should go on and become an addresser. Another way you can also learn how to become a good hairstylist is to watch tutorials online. So while you are doing your apprentice, it's advisable you also watch tutorials on how to make different hairstyles. And this is going to facilitate your learning. So if hairdressing is something that stresses you, then you should go for hairdressing. Now, related to hairdressing is barbie, you know, cutting of hair. For the guys, for the men, they have to cut their hair every two, three weeks so that they you know they can look cute and look presentable. So you can also learn how to cut hair. It's simple to learn this skill because all you have to do is to go to a hair salon to register with a hair salon. Within two, three months, you know, you can become a professional barber. And by the time you learn this skill, you can start cutting hair of, you know, your friends, people around you. And maybe when you go off to university, you know, this skill is going to come handy. So hairdressing and cutting of hair are two very related skills that are lucrative to learn as a teenager another handwork you can learn is makeup artistry you know ladies love to look beautiful and one way to enhance beauty is through the application of makeup if you look around you see during the weekends you know during the weekends you see ladies going for ceremonies they have makeup and when they go for photo shoot i'm talking about birthday photo shoot wedding photo shoot they also apply makeup because makeup is the application of cosmetics product on the face so if, if you can learn makeup artistry become a skillful makeup artistry you are going to make money and to learn this skill you also need to apprentice in a makeup studio so look for a makeup studio around you and you know, tell your parents to register you there 
within three months you learn this skill and you know you become independent and start making little money for yourself so you can learn makeup artistry tailoring is an handwork that is also good to learn as a teenager you know tailors are people who make dresses different kind of dresses you can decide to go for men's wear or women's wear because when you want to become a tailor they ask you which of which of the wares are you interested do you want to sew for men or do you want to sew for ladies because most of the time tailors don't combine both genders so if you are interested in learning how to sew men's dress or women's dress then you can become a tailor and becoming a tailor is going to pay off in the long run because you can take it as a full-time job there are people who are making a living from tailoring so if you learn tailoring you can definitely make money not just even as a teenager but when you grow up you can make money and another advanced way you can make money as a tailor is becoming a fashion designer because fashion designing is the advanced part of tailoring so by the time you grow up and you have the capital you can start your own fashion line you know start sewing dresses for celebrities and people who are going to pay you a lot of money so if you learn tailoring i can assure you that you're not going to regret it because the skill is very lucrative to learn as a teenager now i've been talking about handwork and what handwork there are people who are interested in you no know, digital skills like i know some of you are writers if you can write like you can you have this creative mind you like to you know put down your thoughts in writing then you should consider opening a blog because a blog is a platform where you can write for people to read and when people read your content they find it helpful it's going to pay off because you are going to make money by the time you can amass you know a loyal audience to your blog then you can make money because blogging but then you should know that blogging is not a quick a get rich scheme because it's you know it's going to take you a lot of time to build an audience and when you want to start a blog you must make sure you focus on a topic do not start a blog on diverse topic on you know you are doing this and that so look within you you will discover that there's a particular topic it could be relationship religion finance there's just something that you are very knowledgeable about it could be gaming yeah there are people who write about games write reviews about games on their blog and they are making it so if you are a writer you know you love writing then Blogging is one way you can make money. If you need more information on starting a blog, you can let me know in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Now, another thing is vblogging. Vblogging, I'm talking about YouTube. You can start a YouTube channel where you talk about, you know, different topics, things that interest you. It could be your lifestyle, it could be your heartbeat, you know, it could be anything that anybody wants to watch. Because you will discover that people are ready to watch anything on YouTube and by the time you are able to grow your youtube page you start making money within a short period of time so youtube is one way starting a youtube channel is one way to make money all you have to do is to get a phone with a good camera and you are good to go also if you need assistance to start a youtube channel then you let me know in the comment and i'll give you further advice on starting a youtube channel now programming is also another lucrative skill you can learn it is the it is the number one skill to learn you know as a teenager because the world is going advanced everything is not digitalized programming involves the use of codes to carry out different computer instructions you write a code and the computer carries out that instruction unlike before unlike in the olden days where we have to do things ourselves but now codes are what is used to carry out to perform different tasks so if you can learn a programming language there are different programming languages you can learn as a teenager because a lot of millionaires abroad they are teenagers they are coders they are programmers who are making it big so if you know you like mathematical stuff you, you, if you know you love logic you love mathematics then you should consider programming you can learn programming online there are different free courses you can take to begin your journey as a programmer of course if you need more information on programming you can also let me know in the comments and i will answer your questions another digital skill you can learn is graphic design 
Graphic designers are people who use, you know, art, they use words, they use pictures to create illustrative design. I can bet you that to create illustrative design. You see those banners in your church, in your mocks, you see around, those posters you see in your street. Those are the works of a graphic designer. So if that is something that interests you, then you can learn graphic design because people around you need the service of a graphic designer. And of course, there are jobs you can do online to learn graphic design. Web design is also a lucrative skill you can learn. You see, when you need inquiries, when you have questions to ask, you type on your phone, you go to Google, you search. And when you search for these questions, you know, it leads you to a website. In this website, you read the content, you, you scroll to it, and you get all the information. This website, they are being created by people that are called web designers. You can learn how to create websites. You know, websites that are user-friendly, that are SEO-optimized. To learn this skill, you need to you know, take courses, you know, have to, you need to follow up a lot of guidelines to learn this skill because you can start with WordPress, you can start with other content management system. Also, to learn this skill, you have to watch a lot of tutorials. You can start here on YouTube, you can type on YouTube, how can I become a web designer? And you are, seeing, and you are going to see a lot of videos, a lot of helpful videos you can use to start your web design you know, journey. And if by the time you become a web designer, you can start building websites for organizations. And people are going to hire you because everybody needs a website. Every business needs a website. And that is the reason why web designing is a lucrative skill to learn. Things. So these are some of the practical ways you can make money as a teenager. Uh, if, you have, if you have any question, you need further clarification, do let me know in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. For now, it's bye-bye.